With us on set, this beautifully decorated set now, is Brian with Flowers by Brian. Welcome to the show. Thank you. I've seen you at so many events. Um, these flowers today are spectacular. How did you begin your business, Brian? I started about 27 years ago in Queens in a small store, and today we're uh, out in Long Island in a very big warehouse. Why did you choose to work with flowers? I guess that was uh, when I was a kid. I worked in a flower shop, sweeping the floors and setting up the arrangements, and it just stuck with me. And did you learn uh, the way to design, which is north, south, east, and west? Did you ever learn that? Like you, no. you Oh, okay. So I, I actually <laughs> took a flower decorating oh, wow. class, you know. I mean, <laughs> so the way, I, because it's interesting, because all of yours are almost like free form, very expressive. But have yes. you ever gone somewhere? Well, you probably haven't. But uh, they would stick one tall flower in the center, and then they put one in the north, the south, the east, and the west. And every arrangement looks exactly the same. Yours are different. Yes, well, you know, we have, we work with uh, some very experienced designers that we don't mind taking a little bit of a chance. When you put an arrangement together and you just put one here and one there, theoretically they all come together but in an asymmetrical look. And there are other people that do like the round arrangements where north, east, west, and south, and north or whatever, and that works well too. But the arrangements that we do, it's more custom to what people like. What do you like best about your job? Well, you know, it's a rewarding factor when you see a whole family together and they're just happy and they have smiles on and you've made them happy with the uh, floor arrangements for the wedding or for something every day or um, a new line that I just brought out, which is a DIY uh, do-it-yourself uh, arrangement. Yeah, Skyline Luxury Centerpieces, right? Yes, yes. Yeah, just they're fantastic. It. Yeah, they How came do you, out I mean, beautiful. Like, explain to me a little bit about them. Um, we have them all over the set. So what you do is you, you come with the pieces. Everything you need is in a box? Yeah, everything's okay. in, in the box. The whole centerpiece is in the box. There's directions and a video how to set it up. And um, each arrangement is... Uh, is basically made by us, but then we put it in a box, and then all you really have to do is just take it out and put it together yourself. Wow. So it's easier for the person that really wants to have the hands on and say, you know, I made these, uh -huh. versus, you know, having us come in and do it with our company. So these pieces are sold, you know, on the internet, they're sold all over the country, and it's something that's, you know, we're very excited about. Yeah, it's very, very lovely. So that's mostly the, that's one of the trends that's happening now, is right? Is that people want to yeah, touch they, and they, feel they, some they, things. They're, they're going out of the box a little bit, of do it, do it yourself kind of thing. Um, I, I, I'm all for it. I think it's great. You know, uh, we're trying to, you know, really, you know, make a mark with these uh, boxes and uh, hopefully um, that will happen. Now, I know that you've been invited to be on uh, many television shows, because I've seen you all over the place. I was excited sure. that you could spend some time with us, but you have a new thing in development. What's going on well, with that? Well, we're putting together a show that we're going to show people what's behind the scenes and um, how we make these asymmetrical arrangements or Victorian and lush and full arrangements. And, you know, people could, you know, either do it themselves or come in and hire us, and they'll see exactly how it's done. And what is Flowers by Brian... Um, express well an express is we we've been doing the wedding business for 27 years about two years ago we had a big call for you know flowers for every day anniversaries birthdays um, holidays and um, so we put together an online shopping uh, service all over the island that people are able to uh, pick out something beautiful and that you don't have to buy a whole wedding to have us with you Excellent. And do you have a favorite flower? I know I asked you that before when we had met at a party at an event, and you gave me an answer. Could you repeat that for me and tell it, me it's why? It's mums. Okay. And, <laughs> the, and it's as simple as just a little round mum. Uh, it has such a beautiful fragrance to it. It lasts so long, and and they they just they're beautiful. They're in yellow and purple and white. I just love mums. There you go. Mums always remind me of um, homecoming. You know, because the the big chrysanthemum kind of mum also sure. was always so beautiful. And you're right, all the mums, you know, many different varieties, but they do. They come in different colors. They smell so good. Yeah, they're beautiful, and they last so long. And what's the future hold for you? 
Well, obviously this wonderful new Skyline product, well, uh, right? But yeah, the, the, the Skyline product is beautiful. Um, our wedding business, our express business, and I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll and have see. you ever looked back? Like from no, the moment you started your business, no. you just decided to do it? I always go forward. Always forward. Always forward. You yeah. Know, that's that's uh, in one direction that I go. Now, flowers, too. Um, if you, I don't know if this is a trick or not, but if somebody gives you flowers, let's say, and they're all white roses, can you put food coloring in the water to make the food coloring go up to change the color? What happens is when we receive a flower in, we cut them on an angle and we put them in water. And it gets its first drink and it drinks right up the stem. Okay. Now, the stem is filled with water. So now you're going to take it out and then put it in food coloring or some kind of dye. It's not going to drink. It's already filled with the water. So if you put it from the first cut, then it'll, it'll shoot right up the stem and right into the head and change the color most of the time. Excellent. I was always wondering that, you know. And when you do get um, flowers that arrive in a box, do you recommend that you give them a fresh cut at home and oh, cut absolutely. them on an angle? Fresh cut on an angle, and I would also suggest changing the water every day, every other day, putting lukewarm water in there and keeping them out of the sun and just putting them on, on the table away from the windows and make sure that, the, um, that there's no heat blowing on there. Excellent. I learn something new every time we talk, so thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. Flowers by Brian. It couldn't be thank easier, you. right? You thank got a new you. website that's coming up, and yeah, you're changing things up. Websites Lovely. And, yeah, everything's going to be beautiful. Thank you so much. Thanks oh, for joining us. There pleasure. you go. All right, stay tuned for more. You want some flowers? Go to Flowers by Brian. <laughs>